Hi, it's me again, and I thought I'd go through a bit of document generation setup, just in case yours isn't set up already. So I used a developer org with Omni Studio already installed, and all the setup was done for me. But if that's not the case for you, just a few things to look out for. So the first thing is we need to make sure that ourselves as a user, and also all of our users that are going to be running our documents, have got the Salesforce CRM contact user setting enabled there. And then coming down to our permission sets, we need to make sure that we've got the docgen designer and also docgen runtime user permission sets. All right, secondly, we need to make sure that we've got the docgen template library that's been set up. Um, I'll put a link down below in with the steps that I follow to get that done. So just on my other screen here, I've got the steps to follow so I, make, so I don't make any mistakes. So we do have to go into Salesforce classic mode for this one. So uh, just switching into classic. And then we're going to go into libraries. And if libraries isn't showing there for you, you can click on the uh, plus sign here and we can look for libraries there as well. So you can see here that I've got my docgen, um, my docgen document template library already there. So that was all set up for me. Um, what you might find in your situation is that you don't have anything there. So if I click onto that, you can see all of the documents that I've got within there. So all of the documents that you upload need to go into this docgen document template library. So if you don't have that, uh, like I said, I will post the link uh, with the instructions to follow, but you can essentially click on new and then just follow along with the wizard and set that up there. So if I now open up the library that I already have, it's important down below to have a look at the members. So I've already been added in as a library administrator. Now all of the users that will be using your document generation also have to be members. So the easiest way to do that is to add a public group. So um, over here we've got individual users um, and we've also got public groups. So in my scenario is I went ahead and I added all of the members that need to be, or all of the users that need to run this into a public group. And then I added them with read access. And that's how they then got access to those templates. All right, so the next step now to check in settings is if you go into your document generation settings. You're looking for the entry that says docgen with the document uh, with the docgen document template library, which we set up in the previous step. So, like I said, in my development org here, it was already set up for me, but in my real org that I use for work, I had to set that up myself. And I'll have some instructions uh, below in which to follow. But essentially, you're looking for the same label, same document template library name, and the preview type is PDF. If your templates still aren't showing, um, make sure that the template itself is activated. And if you did create that library just then, you'll need to deactivate the template, uh, save it, and then activate it again. And then go into that library in classic mode and check to see that it's been uploaded. Another place you can check too is the Omni script that you're using to actually run or preview that document. So um, in here we've got a step called de get document templates and that's a data raptor extract action. And you can see the data raptor that it's um, calling there. So if you followed ahead from the beginning and used the sample one that was in the static resources, this should all be set up for you. Um, but if for some reason, um, it's not quite working the way that you would expect it to. Have a look and see what's in this document or this data raptor to see if that's working. Um, and down below, you should have uh, in pick templates, um, you've got some uh, things set there as well. So um, if you have followed from the beginning where we've actually installed the sample pack, um, I would suspect that this is all set up for you. Um, but if you haven't, it may be worth checking this out.